The lesson of this video is Dynamic NAT. You will see how to configure Dynamic NAT in Packet Tracer. We will use the topology on the screen and as you can see there is a local network and outside network and our IP configurations uh, has already done. Let's quickly check the IP configurations on our PCs and the routers. As you can see, our uh, gateway address is uh, 10001, and this is the IP address of uh, the router interface. As you can see, and the other uh, fast Ethernet uh, interface is uh, this address on router, and for router 2. address is here. Here on router 2 uh, we need to uh, add uh, some additional configurations. Uh, for example, we need to say no IP routing here because we will use this router as PC or as device. And we will also uh, say IP default gateway. And uh, let's open uh, the back IP ICMP here and uh, ping the other end for testing. Firstly, and as you can see, uh, we are pinging 10.0.0.2, and uh, this router also uh, see that address. Uh, it is getting replies from uh, the, this address and with NAT configuration uh, we will hide this address and we will change this uh, with different address. Now let's configure dynamic NAT on router 1. Our first Ethernet uh, 00 is uh, not inside. And 01 is not outside. Now we will add an IP pool and we will add this IP pool uh, to the net. Our IP pool's name is IP Cisco and our beginning. This is 505051 and the last IP is 505100 and our NetMask. And here I will add this to the net inside part. And I will add an uh, access list here to accept on our uh, local network. And yes, let's see our uh, configuration. IP not inside for facet net 00, IP not outside for facet net 01, and uh, our IP pool for dynamic not and uh, IP not inside uh, addition and our access list. Now uh, let's ping uh, from router to, to the other PCs and uh, we'll see uh, the changing uh, IP addresses here. As you can see, the source address is uh, 505051 for uh, first PC 
and uh, for the second PC uh, it is 50 50 50 2 and for the last PC it is 50 50 53 yes our uh, dynamic NAT configuration is successful in this video we have configured dynamic NAT in packet tracer we have created an IP pool and we add this uh, to the uh, IP NAT inside and then our PCs get different inside global addresses so the outside network always see different IP addresses for each PC